Hi guys, Sami here. How's it going? So today we have a, quite a different topic than usual. It actually has nothing to do with the game in particular. Um, I want to talk to you about um, what it's like to be a girl streamer. Um, apparently there are a few people interested in that because now and then I get asked like what is it, is it like for me to be a streamer as a girl in particular because um, it's always been a topic like with all the booby streamers around but also lots of other girl streamers that aren't booby streamers complaining about lots of harassment and like the pressure um, so people were asking me about my opinion on this and um, how I feel about it basically. The first point is there are some stereotypes for girls in general besides being a booby streamer. Uh, that's a, a individual point we come to later. Um, one of those stereotypes is girls are not good at video games and girls are not good with technology. I don't think stereotypes are a bad thing right away. Like stereotypes are there for a reason. Um, they always have some truth to them. Like we use stereotypes to categorize humans like people we don't really know. Because of those stereotypes we have like a chance of actually hitting that is higher than 50% basically. <laughs> the problem here is when stereotypes are used to actually generalize how like what girls are like or what humans are like in general. So my only point about that is always be open-minded. So the next point is the bigger one, uh, booby streamers. Um, so I'm f often getting asked if I do feel pressure. Like lots of booby streamers actually made the argument um, that they don't have a chance to compete if they aren't a booby streamer. And I highly disagree with that because like the viewers that are interested in booby streamers are not the viewers that are interested in pure gameplay um, streams. I'm actually getting the question, am I like jealous on the success of a booby streamer? No, because again, like that's, I mean, in some way they even help me because people that I want as a viewer because they are like actually interested in, in what I'm like in the type of stream I'm doing um, they will appreciate the authenticity and um, it, I will also earn like that that sounds really arrogant but that's how it is um, you will also earn respect um, by not being a booby streamer. I'm, I'm the same. I'm always happy to find a good goal streamer that really focuses on gameplay, on community and not on selling um, sex, basically. It's not like I have a problem with selling sex, with other people doing that. It's just that I, uh, I'm not on Twitch to see that. Like I'm on Twitch to see gameplay, I'm on Twitch to see entertainment. The overall most important thing is that viewers that like my stream are most likely also people that are open-minded and also want to watch streamers that are uh, authentic. It's not like the booby streamers would, would steal any viewers from us away. The problem is just they're making Twitch into a porno platform, what we probably do not want. But about the stereotype they are enhancing, people will always be skeptical uh, if you tell them that you're a streamer as a girl. But as I said, as soon as you prove yourself as like just an authentic person, streamer, nerd as a girl, you will draw in the people that sympathize with you and your style. And that's exactly the people you want for your community. The last point is harassment. Of course that happens. But um, every streamer is getting harassed. Uh, it's just that girls are often harassed in another way, like in a more sexual way. But like that's harassment. Harassment like takes the path that is most insulting and most hurting. And as a streamer, you have to deal with that. You have to be able to isolate yourself from such um, insults, not take it to personal and find your own way of how to handle it. Definitely some people are more sensitive than others in that regards. Um, I consider myself not very sensitive. Uh, don't get me wrong, you can definitely trigger me. 
Um, I am a sensitive person in that regard, um, but I'm not really taking un insults from stranger to heart, not at all. So my conclusion on this really is um, booby streamers aren't taking anything from me. They are enhancing a stereotype, yes, but uh, that's what stereotypes are. Um, they are built upon a majority. Um, it's just important that people realize that stereotypes aren't the truth about an individual. They just help you uh, categorize if you don't know the people because you have a chance that it's at least higher than 50% statistically uh, to be right about it. Um, but if you're meeting an individual person, if you're getting to know the individual person, always be open-minded. Um, just acknowledge that every person is different. If people actually think women are not capable of doing it, that's something totally different. That has nothing to do with the stereotype. That's just dumb. Let, just let me get that out there. Like that's a different. I'm talking about the stereotype is okay. A dumb mindset is not okay. <laughs> Some humans are smarter and some humans are not as smart. But continuing with my summary here, um, there's only one real disadvantage I sometimes feel and that is the really not good at games stereotype. Um, I mean, I'm not saying I'm like the best at video games, but I would say I'm decent since I am playing since I'm a little child. But yeah, I feel that that stereotype does hit me quite a bit. Uh, because the people, like the viewers that actually fit my kind of stream, my kind of content, are ambitious people like me, right? But uh, those people tend not to click on a gold stream because they don't expect ambitious, focused gameplay. I sometimes have a feeling that I'm actually not reaching the people that are uh, would tend to like my content because they will filter already on the list. Maybe it would be actually easier if I didn't have a webcam on my stream. On the other hand, like there are also lots of people interested in girl streamers, so I'm getting views from that, right? If you as a girl streamer are not a booby streamer and you're like focusing on the gameplay and you're just a good streamer, um, I think you earn a lot of respect and um, have some advantages over there. That's really my take on it. Um, I really don't know what uh, whether you will like this kind of video or not. I actually have some other topics too um, on my list, which also are not directly to a uh, game related. Um, please tell me if you like this kind of just talking um, opinion comment commentary content. Don't worry, I'm not gonna become a YouTube drama channel. <laughs> but yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you liked the video, please hit that like button. It really helps me a lot. Um, also, subscribe when you're at it, uh, if you didn't yet. If you didn't like that video, no problem. Hit that thumbs down button. Uh, I would really appreciate it, though, if you could leave a comment and tell me um, what you didn't like so I can better myself in the future. Uh, thank you so much for watching. See you on the next one. Bye bye.